system, which has a water treatment plant at this point, which is almost midstream, between the Kaimosi complex, where the university is, and some institutions there, and Shamahoho. So it supplies those two. It's the smallest of these uh, three projects. Uh, it supplies about 2,500 meter cubed okay. per day. It also supplies Sabatia, which is just uh, away there. Yes. Then we have where we are today, mm -hmm. which is the Mbale water treatment system. So this is a treatment plant. Where we are standing is part of this. It goes to Javakali, it goes to Mbale, it goes to Munoyu. So those are the areas that it supplies. Then we have the last one, which is the Marceno system. The Marceno system supplies the Musire. The water treatment plant is here. It also uh, supplies the Sirabe. It supplies a, bubu, a Bubi. Uh, it also supplies the Kima area, where we have the a, a Munua tank. Then we have a Busakami, which is along the road, and Luanda, and the Marceno complex. So all these projects produce an additional 12,500 uh, meter cubed per day, and we are very, very grateful for the support of your government for invest, investing in this project, because after water, food comes, and we realize that uh, under your better uh, uh, priority projects, water is, and sanitation is one of the key planks, followed by food. Uh, so we have a total of 17,600 meter cubed that is being produced. We are able to serve 313,000 uh, people by 2033, and the ultimate is 394, which is about 400,000. We need additional investment of about 600 million shillings for the three systems to reach the farthest uh, of the people that can benefit from this project. Under this, uh, uh, under this area of Lake Victoria North, we cover about uh, six counties, and uh, we know that uh, when you took office, uh, you prioritized uh, 100 dams. So we have about six dams which we have proposed within this uh, area. Uh, we have Kikurere Dam, we have Keben Dam, we have uh, Angololo Dam, which is in uh, Busia town. We have Malakisi Dam, and uh, we have uh, uh, Tongaren Dam. So these dams will be part of uh, the 100 dams. Yes. Then we have some other small projects. Uh, which, uh, talk about yeah, Kaimusi is yes, yes, is rehabilitation. It is in existence. Yes, the Kaimusi Dam is uh, within Vihiga County. We have the Higa Cluster, which I've just talked about, and we are mentioning here Kipkurere Dam, which requires 16 billion shillings. We are reporting it under Vihiga and Nandi because it is capable of actually serving those two counties comprehensively if it is done. Now we have a Cape Talk at Kolongolo, which is in Transoya County. It is complete. It is just waiting commission. Yes. And we have uh, other projects uh, in Busia, like the Malaba water and sanitation. The sanitation component is complete. We just have some 100 meters that we are still discussing with Kenya Railways to allow us to finish, and then it will be working. Yeah, Mudete Dam. Yeah, Mudete Dam is here. It's only that it's not... It was not a very large dam okay. and a large project, so that's, that's it. So we welcome you to the Shumara Tua. Ataelekea kufungua rasmi bamba la uzinduzi wa shuguli hii ya leo. Amo kipenda mbradi huu. Na kisha bada yapo kutakuwa na upanzi wa mti. Na apewe ziyana rasmi. So, this is a president. This is solar. This is the first project that we have actually powered the whole project using solar. So the three cluster projects have prioritized solar. Here we are producing 185 kilowatts uh, to run this particular facility. What, what was that? Uh, this, this is a purification system. Because when you do water treatment, you remove the sludge and the refuse that comes from the filters. So you stabilize it so that the settlement of the heavy materials, and then you clarify it through the vegetative part. And then, it goes then now we can discharge it back to the environment. Yes. So, Karibu. Thank you. Well, 
So this day.